If you live in an area where you have to store your batteries, let's say from a snowmobile to a boat, where it's going to be off season for a while, chances are you're going to wind up with a dead battery sooner or later. And in this video, I'm going to show you how to force charge a battery. Now most battery chargers, just like the Stanley Fat Max, has to sense some type of voltage from the battery to start charging. So if this battery is down to around 3 volts, this charger is not going to kick on. You need at least like 5-6 volts for a battery charger to sense the battery and start charging it. So what happens? Do you just get, turn the battery in and buy a new one? Or I'm going to show you a battery charger. You can actually force charge this battery for about 5 minutes, get the voltage up, and then it's going to turn on its normal charging cycle. So let's get started. So I'm just going to check the voltage on this battery real quick. And we're running right around 3.1 volts. I'm just going to show you what happens when you have a battery this low. I'm going to go ahead and turn on the Stanley Fat Max. This is an 8 amp charger. I also use this just for like a battery maintainer to keep on my marine batteries throughout the winter. Now if I turn it on rapid charge, notice nothing's happening. That's because the voltage is so low, the charger is not sensing anything, so it's not going to do anything. It's showing charge, but it's not showing charging or charged. So I'm going to show you the battery charger you need to jump start this battery. Now whenever you hook up a battery charger, you want to do positive first, then negative, then you want to plug in the charger. The battery charger I want to feature in this video is the NOCO Genius 1. I'm going to go ahead and plug it in. It's going to try to sense the battery. And what I'm going to do is I'm going to hit the mode button for five seconds. And now when that little orange light lights up, I'm going to hit the mode button again. And I'm going to tell it this is a 12 volt battery. And it's going to start force charging it. It's going to go through a cycle for about five minutes. And then it's going to turn on its normal trickle charge. I don't recommend using an extension cord for your battery chargers. I'm just using one to show you guys up close of what this looks like. As you can see by the meter, we have 12.15 volts. Now that's how you force charge a dead battery. Now if you're under 3 volts, and this is a marine battery, it's going to take this little charger about 18 hours to charge it back to full. After you charge this for a couple hours, you can put on maybe a faster charger, but you're going to need this to get those volts up to at least 6 volts for another type of battery charger with a microprocessor to sense that battery and get it charging again. Hope you guys pick up one of these at your local auto parts store or you can buy these off Amazon with my link below. Hope you guys enjoyed the video and thanks for watching.